Puri is a coastal city in the state of Odisha in eastern India. It is situated on the Bay of Bengal, 60 km south of the state capital of Bhubaneswar. It is one of the original Chardham pilgrimage sites for Hindus. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, the famous Bengali Indian spiritual leader from 15th century, spent the last 24 years of his life in Puri. Since then, Puri has become like a second home of many Bengali people. If you are coming to Puri, then the very first place you should visit is the Jagannath Temple. The Jagannath Temple is an important Hindu temple dedicated to Lord Jagannath, a form of Krishna. The present temple was rebuilt from the 10th century onwards on the site of an earlier temple and begun by Anantavarman Chodha Ganga Deva, the first king of the Eastern Ganga dynasty. Orisha is actually known as the land of Lord Jagannath, literally meaning the Lord of the Universe. This temple has been the epicenter of Jagannath cult and sees pilgrims flocking the temple town of Puri from all corners of the world throughout the year. After Jagannath Temple, the second most important place in Puri is of course the Konark Sun Temple. It's a 13th century CE Sun Temple at Konark, which is about 35 kilometers northeast from the Puri city. The temple is attributed to King Nara Simha Deva I of the Eastern Ganga dynasty about 1250 CE. Dedicated to the Hindu sun god Surya, what remains of the temple complex has the appearance of a hundred foot high chariot with immense wheels and horses, all carved from stone. Once over 200 feet high, much of the temple is now in ruins. In particular, the large Shikara tower over the sanctuary. At one time, this rose much higher than the mandapa that remains. The structures and elements that have survived are famed for their intricate artwork, iconography and themes, including erotic karma and mithuna scenes, also called the Surya Devalaya. It's a classic illustration of the Odisha style of architecture or Kalinga architecture. Konark Sun Temple is depicted on the reverse side of the Indian currency note of 10 rupees to signify its importance to Indian cultural heritage. The name Konark derives from the combination of the Sanskrit words Kona that means corner and Arka the sun. The context of the term Kona is unclear but probably refers to the southeast location of this temple either within a larger temple complex or in relation to other sun temples on the subcontinent. The Arka refers to the Hindu sun god Surya. 
The next place is the Shanti Stupa of Dholagiri, which is known as the Peace Pagoda. Dholagiri lies at a distance of 7 km from Bhubaneswar. As one travels from Bhubaneswar to Puri, one finds Shanti Stupa. Since King Ashoka adopted the path of peace and tranquility and resorted to Buddhism, he laid the foundation of Dhaulagiri Shanti Stupa at a place which is known for the end of Kalinga War. Here one finds the Edict of Lord Buddha, which is visited by numerous Buddhist devotees. While returning from Konark to Puri, you must visit Chandrabhaga Beach, which is situated just 3 km east of the Sun Temple. This beach on the coast of Konark becoming India's first to get the Blue Flag Certification a tag given to environment-friendly clean beaches. Well, Puri is not only a town of temples and beaches. It's actually very famous for different kinds of sweets. And the most famous sweet is the crispy dessert known as Khaja. If you're coming to Puri, Khaja is a must-try item. This particular form of sweet is not only famous in Puri but also very popular in some parts of Bengal. Another iconic place of Puri is the Shorgodar beach and the adjacent road. Shorgodar is the cremation ground of Hindus. Shorgo means heaven and Dwar means gateway. However, this busy place has many shops, food joints. So if you are coming to Puri, then it's a kind of place you should visit, particularly at night. On the Shorgudar beach after sunset, you can actually enjoy mouth-watering foods. Even if you don't want to do anything, just go to the beach from the local shops, you hire a chair and enjoy the night view. Promise you won't get bored.